Hello, friends and meisters. Welcome back to the Familia's Exploits in Persona 5. Last time, we learned a bunch of things about Madarame. He had this huge facade of a nice, genuine, down-to-earth person, but he still had a palace, which really made us second-guess things. Upon further examination, we found that he's been abusing his students, stealing these pupils' artwork, and selling it as his own. And we even went as far as to question Yusuke about it, although a little heavy-handedly, admittedly, because that didn't end well for us. But we kind of just confirmed those suspicions that this man is stealing his work, but Yusuke believes he owes him for taking him in, which I can't agree with. From there, we basically left off with a message from Nakonohara, the guy we stopped from stalking that lady in the metaverse, which I believe was also the one that drew Sayuri. I could be wrong, but I... I think that's what it is. We'll find out today because we're going to go meet with him so that we can get more information to steal Madarame's heart. And Cat Mom wouldn't let us do anything, so a <laughs> bad time it is. Okay, or not, because it didn't. There we go. Let's call it a day and go to bed. Yeah, we'll sleep. Starting today, our new hideout is the walkway in Shibuya. Alright? Speaking of Shibuya, didn't Mishima say Nakonohara would be there now too, Meow? Yeah, yeah, you did. So we better go investigate. Talk to this Nakonohara, see if we can find any yeah. info. We're about to head to the hideout too. Mm -hmm. Good timing. Like, who's that? Excuse me. That's Nakonohara. Shima told us to meet him here in Shibuya today. For real? Um. My name is Nakonohara. Nakonohara, the one who posted on about on the was posted about on the Phantom Aficionado website. He seems pretty nice. Doesn't sound like the stalker type. I think the change of heart must have worked. The administrator of the website contacted me. They told me to look for someone in Shujin's uniform with a cat. Hmm. So, what do you want? You may have already heard that there's someone I wish to trigger a change of heart in. An artist by the name of Manorame. Hey. Oh, you think this is it? Is the pupil going to confess his master's secrets? His show did mention Manorame as well. Or Shadow. I'm one of Manorame's former pupils. He gave me a lodging at his home where I thought only about art. I genuinely wanted to be an artist. Uh, there was another pupil as well. A very talented man, multiple years my senior. Obviously, Manorame kept tabs on him. Everything he made was claimed as Manorame's original. He wasn't the only victim, though. Huh. Alright, we got some real proof of plagiarism. In response to Madarame's actions, that senior pupil committed suicide. Huh? Is it suicide? He must have been unable to bear seeing his work praised under Madarame's name. <sighs> that was when I disobeyed Madarame's pleas and left. But he quickly pressured other parts of the art world, and my life as a painter was destroyed. I tried to turn over a new leaf, working as a ward office at a word office, but it was no use. My attachment to art warped my emotions. Soon I began getting attached to everything. In the end, I even turned into a stalker. Disgusting. <laughs> eh. I'd like to ask again, please. Hey, Karaname, or Madarame, have a change of heart. Not only for me, it's to save the life of another man as well. Another man? There's more at stake here than just you two. Save their life? Even now, there's still one young man remaining under Madarame's tutelage. Oh, talking about Yusuke. I think he's about your age. I don't want to see his career destroyed like mine. That has to be Yusuke! Meow. Not only is he a talented artist, he also owes Madarame for taking him in after his mother passed. He is the perfect target. 
So Yusuke's got no choice but to listen. I actually spoke to him a few times back when I was still living at Matarame's. I asked him if he found it painful to stay with Matarame. And you know what he said? If I could leave, I would. Oh, I really want to help him out now. So he's just feigning ignorance because ignorance he thinks he can't leave. Itagawa kun I have no right to say this given my prior cowardice, but I don't want to see another suicide. I'd like to find a way to save this young man before he ends up like me. He has a bright future ahead of him. Please consider that when thinking about changing Madarame's heart. Oh, so Nakanohara wasn't really a bad guy, it's just... All that shit that happened to him, he got so twisted. It's all understandable. I love how this game handles victims and, and villains even. They all have a reason, a justification, something that made them the way they are. You can't really bring yourself to hate them as much as you want to. Well, I still hate Kamoshida, but I can understand the reasons behind his actions. You've been asked to act directly on behalf of Madarame's victims, Meow. It sounds like we don't have time to deliberate whether or not we... or not to change Madarame's heart. Yeah, you're right, Morgana. Hell yeah! Madarame just a piece of shit of praise on the weak. <laughs> Suicide? I'll never let something like that happen again. Plus, we finally got to hear how Kitagawa-kun Kitago really feels. Okay. Well, since we've reached a unanimous decision, how about we continue to er, to hear this at our hideout, Meow? That is a good idea, Morgana. We need to discuss how we would like to proceed. I still need to make those goddamn lockpicks. My fellow thieves, welcome to our new hideout. I talked over that. My fellow thieves, welcome to our new hideout. Mm. Our target this time is Matarame. We all saw that palace. We'll pay dearly if we assume it's just going to be like the last one. Furthermore, Lady An's chastity is on the line. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't recall it being that crazy. What? Yeah, that's what I was saying. We'll need to do what we did with Kamoshida. First, we secure an infiltration route in the palace. After that, we send our calling card. Once the treasure has materialized, we steal it. Oh, oh, I got a question. Uh, Matarame doesn't know that we were doing stuff in the palace yet. Why are we already getting treated like criminals in there? You're learning, Ryuji. Well done. Hmm, yes. Ryuji isn't as dumb as he makes himself out to be. It must be because he doesn't trust anyone. Any unknown person may as well be an enemy. Or maybe he's just super salty from all those rumors that have been spreading about him. <laughs> well, that's a possibility, I guess. Then his palace being so crazy had nothing to do with us? Either way, we should stay on our best behavior. It'll be harder for us to steal the treasure if we needlessly increase the security level. We need to be careful of Kitagawa-kun this time, too. I'm sure that whatever he sees will just get passed on to Madarame. That's right. Oh, gosh. Like our actions yesterday? That's what I'm worried about. Hey, what is Madarame's treasure going to look like anyway? Another crown? I doubt that, but my sixth sense will know when I see it. Oh yeah, you go completely nuts, huh? Our time limit is when the exhibit ends, right? That means... June 5th. We'll carry out the plan after we've sent out the calling card. So our infiltration route will need to be set in stone two days prior on June 2nd. Now listen here! We can't mess this up, no matter what, okay? Yeesh, yeesh, my blessing. My blessing, I got this. Don't you worry, we won't allow him to make you pose nude. Okay. This is the first job for the Familia. So let's make sure we do it right. Come on, it's time to get this Meowshin started. Your mission to change Madarame's heart has begun. You must steal his heart by the deadline. Occasionally, you will encounter palace obstacles that are impassable and require interacting with the target in the real world. 
You will need to leave the palace to find the obstruction. Enter palaces quickly to find obstacles and try and both challenges before the deadline. Now that makes me second guess. We might not be able to do everything in run run, but I'm gonna try to do as damn well as much as possible. We also have the requests, but before I wanna go in, I kind of wanna back out of this. Huh? We'll make some lock picks and then go in. That's the idea at least. We'll get a proficiency bonus anyway, so it's not like we're wasting the time entirely. So I love how making equipment works in this game. But we also have some confidence that we could hang out with, like the prison master. Oh, wait, no, that's Igor. We can't hang out with him. It just advances when it feels like it. But we also can hang out with, uh, you know, Sojiro on Ryuji, Black Alley Doctor. We even have Yuki Mishima. And then we have, um... oh gosh, I'm trying to remember. I have to try to start that beef bowl social link. The one with that one guy. I think he has one too from what we understand. We have a lot to do. A lot on our plates, if you will. Oh, and it's a Wednesday. So, what I'll do then is we'll actually take... Oh, what's this about? Some crazy Matarame shit. Ah! But what I need to do is check our map. Okay, so I'm not seeing any other social links in Aoyama or Shibuya. Just in Yogenjaya. Uh, yeah, yep. Let's go to the back streets. We'll check on the doctor. The good old doctor of the back alley. And we'll see what's going on with her. <sighs> the warmer it gets, the harder it is. Has everyone ever studied the correlation between the rise in world or temperatures and weirder weirdos? So what are you here for today? Mm. I made some more refinements to the medicine. Could I have you come in? I feel like I can become closer with Takemi thanks to the deaf persona McCoy. I feel like my bond with Takemi will grow stronger soon. Ooh, that means it is definitely a time to hang out with Takemi. Probably. I'm just going to review this for a second. That's right, we unlocked more, like, items from her, so let's back out for a second. We're just going to check the items real quick, and then we'll hang out with her. That's probably the best idea, so we don't waste time. Okay, Takemi. Hmm? Please head to and the let's exam. head into the exam room. I'll show you my special stock. My guinea pig. Okay, which one? Okay, so this is the new stuff here. Roger clear R. Soon to clear R and rejuvenating IV. Why you have such a serious look on your Ooh, that restores 100% of HP. I really, really like that. I was buying those, uh, what are they called? Healing IVs prior, which were restoring 50%. The question is, is it worth it? 1800 to 3600. You know what? That, that is worth it. It's not going to cost us any extra in the end. Uh, oh, okay. And it takes up less inventory space, too. 34. I'm thinking these are still more efficient, though. In the end, that's 3,600. No, no, it's the exact same. You want that one? But let's get a couple of these. Not too many. I still need some money, yeah. after all. New antiseptic made by TMC. Remove stat debuffs for one ally. That seems useful as well. Explains why it's, you know, expensive. Removes it for one foe. Okay, as well. Take care. What was that Nohar? Hmm? I don't remember that. Please head to the exam room. Well, which do you want? Okay, yeah, that's everything. Out we go. And let's hang out with her. Hmm? Well then. So this is the Takemi Medical Clinic of Eternal Medicine. I'm glad it's still open. 
All right, yeah, I have a child I need to have examined. Oh, looks like I have a patient with an emergency. Just wait here. And? So, why come here? Aren't you under the care of another hospital? I've heard rumors about this place. I'd like for you to examine her. She was diagnosed with bronchitis, but the medicine she was given hasn't been working at all. She has a fever that won't go away. She's losing weight, but she's not hungry. A young girl losing weight is definitely not good. You should go to a bigger hospital. I can't provide a thorough examination here. Even going to a big hospital, a university hospital in East Shinjuku. But all they tell us is that it's persistent bronchitis. It can't be right. <sighs> a university hospital? In East Shinjuku. Is this the one she used to practice at? The doctor there performs exams like he's on an assembly line. I think he's famous or something. A famous doctor. Hmm. I'm just a general practitioner out here in the sticks. As you can see, I don't even have any staff. Wait, I've heard there's a medicine that can only be acquired here. Please, I'll pay you. Please, at least just examine her. Uh, hey. Uh, hold on. <laughs> Doctor, chest really hurts. Mm. Come on, Takemi. Oh, I feel bad for her. Dr. Kemi will help. <gasps> what? Doctor. <sighs> Fine. Hmm. Is your vision blurry? How about your throat? Does it hurt? Hmm. No signs of swelling. Are you sure you told me everything about her symptoms and treatments you've tried so far? Yes, I'm sure. Hmm. Hello? Hello. Uihara-san, is Dr. Schwitzer in there? There's something I'd like to ask him about a case that was in last month's medical journal. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I see. Guess the ones in stock will have to do. There's a shelf by the reception desk. Bring the contents of the second drawer into the exam room, please. You'll need to help me administer the medicine. Also, bring the beaker with the red label in the fridge. A towel, a wash basin, and measuring spoon. <sighs> well, what are you waiting for? Get moving. Yes, ma'am. Th thank you so much. I didn't expect her to recover so quickly. Mm. It was a very unique strain of an infectious disease. It can't be detected by conventional exams. I temporarily suppressed the symptoms. We'll make adjustments as her condition improves. Okay. That'll be 1 million yen for today. Holy shit! <laughs> A million yen? That's outrageous! You're completely taking advantage of... I mean... Alright, I agreed to pay. You don't take credit cards, do you? I'll go withdraw some cash right now. <gasps> huh? Wait, you're actually going to pay? By the way, that famous doctor you mentioned earlier, wasn't medical chief of staff o Oyamade Armada? Yes, are you familiar with him? I knew it. In that case, I'll make this free of charge. Free? <laughs> you seem happy there. <laughs> Doesn't it feel good, healing his patient without permission? Mmm, so there's some beef between you two. By the way... By the way, thanks to your outbursts earlier, I'm going to perform a very special exam on... <laughs> oh no! I'm going to perform a very special exam on you today. <laughs> oh god! So is he your assistant? He seems awfully young. Yes, my assistant, guinea pig. He's about to put in a lot of hard work today, aren't you? <laughs> Please don't 
make me a mutant or something. Oh, I actually like Takemi. She has this hard shell, but you know, she's nice down down inside. And she actually seems like a really competent doctor. Back alley doctor, rank right. four. You will now earn more XP from the Arcana Burst when using Personas of the Death Arcana. And not the ones that can't hear. You know, the ones that kill things. I'm um, doctor, can I go back to school now? Not for a while. You'll need to start eating and regain your strength first. Can you do that for me? Yes, thank you, doctor. <sighs> Don't mention it. Your turn. I wonder what kind of response you'll have this time. Mm. Maybe you won't even be able to make it home. Oh no. If you like cooperating in that shady clinical trial, it'll increase my guts. Not the strength to take on the world. All right. Bye. Okay, good work today. Yeah, we really got put to work. We even helped save a little girl. Not save her, I guess, but cure the disease. She might have been in trouble if she kept going the way she was. Uh, you're back. Hey! Don't forget to ask the airsoft guy about the paper bag. Yeah, we haven't done that, but I believe the reason for that is we didn't have enough guts to do so, was it? We can go try again, but that's what I believe was the issue last time. Ooh, we also have other stuff we could do. I want to make tools tonight, though. That's what I want to do. It can't hurt to do a quick save. And then we can try going back to that guy. But I'm pretty certain I needed better guts last time I was there, so we'll see. You got that? Yeah, yeah, I won't get in any trouble, don't you worry, Sojiro. I won't stay up too crazy late. Was it Central Street? I believe it was. Oh god, we have those tickets. Am I forgetting about those? It was in May that we were supposed to go turn them in. I don't remember which day, though. You know what? Let's go to the Station Quare real quick and see if we won the lottery again. Because last time it was a winner winner chicken dinner, I tell you. I have a lottery ticket. Yeah, so let me to check the results. Your result in this drawing is... Congratulations! You won 300 yen. <laughs> That's not a lot. We won a lot more last time. But we can't win it big every time. You won, but I guess it's better than nothing. Yeah, it is. Welcome. Let's put it right back into another lotter ticket. I'm probably wasting much more money than I'm spending here. Thank you for your patronage. The result will be announced on the 25th of May. Let's do some scratchers. Hi. Go receive your scratcher results instantly. Yeah. All right, let's scratch away. Well, let's see. You can scratch on any of these three spots. Let's go ahead and get them all. Oh, man. It's a miss. What's the next one? Oh, man. God darn it, Joker! You have terrible luck. Okay. One more. Oh, wah, wah. they're all misses, Joker. You picked the wrong ticket again. Let me pick next time. Thank you very much. We look forward to your next visit and wasting your money. Ah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that wasn't very profitable this time around. But it's fun, okay? So we'll do it. It is a thing we will do. Oh, it's Mishima. I didn't realize we could hang out with him at night. Hi. You remember that group a while back? We're claiming to hack websites in the name of justice. I had pretty high hopes for them, but they turned out to be posers. The Phantom Thieves are true heroes, though. I want to help them out however I can. Hey, do you remember that horrible person I texted you about? You're going to change their heart, right? If anyone can do it, it's the Phantom Thieves. You're right, we probably should. Probably should, but we'll worry about it a little later. Like I said, I don't want to waste my time right now, especially with having to go through Monorame's palace. We have a lot on our plate. You again? Uh, you're gonna try and sell me something weird. Hey! That modified gun could be a powerful weapon to use during palace battles. Let's ask him about what's inside the bag. Don't freak out, Kyoya. Just ask him. Yeah, we need Gaunt. 
Okay, I was right. We need dauntless guts. We don't have enough to ask him. We might as well sell the items while we're here. I guess that's fine. Mm. Give me that money. Uh, come again. Down here. Go home, kids. Not like I like you or anything. I guess he doesn't want his bag back if we have to have dauntless guts to ask him about the dad damn thing. All right. Well, let's go home. Make those lock picks so tomorrow I can go into the palace. Yes. Oh, actually, do we even have enough stuff to make lock picks? That is a good question. Yeah, I have my 10 clasps. I believe that's what we needed for them. Now we can check and come back. Not like we'll be forced to stay inside afterwards. Unless Cat Mom has anything to say about it. Aha, we have enough. Okay. Okay. So you want to make a lockpick? Yeah, we do. We're going to be prepared this time, I tell you. What are your thoughts? Did you finish? We did. Oh, you can still make more. What do you plan to do? Continue. I'd be stupid to stop here. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Mm. Not bad. What are your thoughts? Did you finish? Mm. Oh my god. Lock. Locke is here with me today. At this pace, you should be able to make one more. Yeah, we will. Okay. I have three lock picks now. Mm. Not bad. What are your thoughts? Did you finish? Oh, you're definitely getting better. I can tell just yeah. by watching you. Oh my god, we got all the lock picks we needed, and we got a crazy increase to our proficiency. All right. That wow. is worth it. And then we can just go into Madarami's palace with like a billion lockpicks. I will get those chests, I tell you. Every shiny will be mine. I am the shiny finder. Do, 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 you. do. So it is you. You did use this line. Now that I think about it, I hope you understand. I warn you, don't involve yourself any further. Waiting for me? Were you? No. What do you mean about them? What do you mean? Don't play dumb. I'm saying you're an inconvenience. I won't forgive you if you continue making a mockery of my sensei. Am I clear? This is a warning. You are clear. We'll avoid you and go behind your back to kick your sensei's ass. Sound like a, sounds like a plan to me. No need to stir up trouble when there's no need to. Anyhow, our plans were basically to meet up with the group and head on in. And Ryuji's already bugging us about it. What are we doing about the palace, man? Can't we meeting up? If you don't know uh, what to do, let's just go. Let's go for it. Should we meet up with him? We'll decide later. We had just went ham on some lock picks. Absolutely crazy. Even Morgana was like, Damn, that's five lock picks, Joker. Your hands are moving faster than an assembly line. How the heck are you doing that? Like, we made an absolute monster amount of five lock picks in one sitting, so I'm super happy about that. Going to Kamoshida's palace, we had nowhere near the same amount. Speaking of which, that's what we're going to do today with the Familia. We're going to infiltrate. Uh, Matarame's palace and hopefully get as far as we can. It did mention there might be some obstacles within the palace. We'll have to, you know, find a way to overcome in real life. Hopefully we don't hit too many of them. I'm hoping to make better time this time around. However, before we go in, there's a few things we should do. It is raining, so I probably want to go visit that machine. We did experience some interesting stuff there, you know. What are you doing, Makoto? Oh. Oh, are you alone today? I had heard you were quite the troublemaker, but you seem to be behaving yourself. Mmm. You're definitely not doing that just to listen in our conversations. Totally not. Mmm, Makoto. Kind of cute how she does that, actually. But we'll see what happens with her later. She's currently stalking us for the fat principal. And what I want to do now is I want to go to the machines and see if there's any special drinks. 
Those special drinks are definitely worth the looking. Are you thinking of buying something to drink? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, we already have these. I remember one of the machines selling, uh, I think it was SP restorative. I wasn't sure if it was during the rainy days or not. Yeah, I don't think it is. We'll check all the machines like around just to see if it is the case. Because we're also going to go by a few places. Like I'm going to go by the gun guy shop. If I remember correctly, his machine stuck. And then we got an item. So maybe we can get special items from him similar in Persona 4. We went to like one of those little ball machines that would spit out random items. And we get some good stuff sometimes on rainy days. I'm just looking for more vending machines. I can never remember where all of them are. So that's pretty much the plan today before we go to the hideout. Uh, Station Square. Nope, Central Street it is. I'll also have to go underground, I think, to check some of uh, the machines down there. You want to buy something to drink, Joker? It's just all the same ones here. Oh, we're missing that one. Throwing a latte. Made from the King of Fruits restores 10 HP to one ally. And we have Creature, which cures sleep for one ally. That actually seems useful, and it's pretty cheap. Oh, can we only buy two? Okay, it's sold out now, yeah. We'll buy a couple of those. Those can't be bad. I'm hoping they come in use for us later. And we'll go see the Untouchable Gun Shop, because we're just untouchable. Oh, it says Taste Test. The Rations of World of War. Or of the World, Volume 37. It costs 800 yen per try. Let's give it a go. Yeah, let's do it. Why not? Capsule's a bit sticky. Oh, you got lucky there. Got lucky. Yeah, I remember him saying that. Oh, cures hunger for one ally. Is that well? Is hunger a thing? If we're going to a palace too long. Are we going to get hungry and like slowly or get weaker stats? Because I know fatigue was a thing in Persona 3. If the game told us, I don't remember being told about it. Yeah, that's Big Bang Burger. No. Oh, the umbrella. The umbrella action during the rain is just so cool. There's actually a lot of things we could do. Like, I could even go study, but I'm, I am resolved. I'm resolved to go into the palace and do our thing today. There's a workout shop, which we've yet to go into. Where the hell is this arcade? We got into it once. There it is. Well, I can't find it, so we'll just use a quick select menu. You gonna buy something to drink? Mm hmm. I was right about the SP items. They're here. I was trying to remember where they were. Oh, we already have Creature and Dr. Salt Neo. I'll just buy two in case I use one. That's what I was trying to find, because I know there's SP recovery items in some of these machines because we already bought them. And I am going to be the man to find every drink in this something. game, I swear. No. Up at Kiyo, yeah. So, the next stop is the... Where is it? Underground walkway. And then we'll head over quickly to our home place and then back to the hideout to continue on. Is that the drink machine? That is not. I swore there were some down here. But it's not the first time I've been wrong. I'm sorry, but we're sort of about Uji today. Uh, come back on Sunday. Okay. What I'm kind of curious is, is there anything like the Persona 4, I think, in the golden one? Apparently, there is like a beef ball shop that you could go ahead in and get like super stat ups. Yeah, I'm not seeing any machines down here. Father is drink machines. I guess I'm just plain wrong. That was a thing, apparently. So, back we go to the home place, Uya Station. Back to Yogan. I'm gonna buy a drink? No reason for a high school student to be here. Welcome. What would you like? Okay. Off to the hideout it is then. Oh, oh yeah, 
at the hideout right now. The excess way. Oh. Everyone's here. I had to click on it, okay. Or hit X on it. Let's change Monorame's heart fast and prove what we're doing is right. Yep, yep, that's what we'll do. We can hold the meeting, but what we'll do is infiltrate the palace. Go. We're going in. The game is just so smooth. That little intro there. Just him standing there in front of the palace. It's just, oh, it's beautiful. I'm sure you already know this, but the first thing we need to do is secure an infiltration route. Then we send the calling card. Yeah, yeah. We know the drill. Anyways, let's get ready. Oh, hey, Velvet Lolly. Good to see you here. We may need your services. Well, we already know the way in we're going. Well, I could go a different way, couldn't I? Security's tight at the front entrance. We should bypass them in another way. Okay, Cat Mom won't let us. I was hoping I could just, like... Get the drop on a couple of the security guards, kick their butts, maybe get a persona or two out of it, but I guess we'll have to wait. Somewhere. Uh, didn't we already steal this art piece? Focus. Um, okay. I am not even complaining about that. A loot item is a loot item after all. I have something. Gonna let me do it again here? No, okay. They completely smashed this way. Gonna jump on his back? Nope. This place is super arty, though, for, like, a museum. Hmm. Well, we got our infiltration point, Morgana. Hmm. Not a lot's changed. Ooh. Items. Focus. Uh, what Focus. the hell? Focus. They were all green before, I guess... They're armed now. Whoa. Wait, Joker! Ugh. It's an infrared laser device. If we touch it, the security will increase. Hold on. There wasn't anything like this last time, though. The rumors might slowly be making Matarame become more wary of us. Well, not to mention we went in and was, like, to his place of home and accused him of it. Joker, they're not easy to see, but you should be able to do it with your skills. Be careful. Very careful, Meow. You can detect infrared lasers with the third eye. There is a wide enough gap you can slip through by pressing the X button. It can also be done by holding the X button as you approach. But remember, you can only pass through if there's enough room. Yeah, so don't run right through it. Oh, all the grooviness. Ooh, are we finding some security finally? Mm-hmm. There's finally some security. Oh, that one does not have a gap. That one does, though. We just gotta be careful what we're doing. That guy going. I really want to jump on him first so that we don't get seen. That's at least the idea. Hidden. Take him out. Show me your true form. Now's our chance to strike. Mm. That reminds me, we have to make Yusuke face itself. Phase out. Oh. Persona 4 music. It brings back good memories. Hey, we already fused a McCoy. We know what he's weak to. Go to Hound. Go to town, Morgana. Well, we already have one of you, so let's just take you out. Darn right. Make them bleed the colors of a rainbow. Meow. Okay. It's one down. That was easy. Ooh, there is a gap here. I just don't want to get caught. Is that guy going to come around? Oh, what the hell? Damn it. There's a guy right behind us. They just wrecked us. These three are weak. Oh, don't you dare. You stop that. 
No, 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 stop shaking your hips at me, no. You're going down. This is not a good situation. Let's just break this. Still, mate. It's almost scary how good I am. Bam, wham, thank you, ma'am. What we call the downtown city beatdown. You cat style, meow. All that money, though. Way, way more than we got prior. And we're done. Come on, let's go. Hmm, there you are. It's close enough to strike. Probably sneak past them, though. And that place is. No one come over here. Oh, okay. That might be a little more difficult than I thought. Damn it. Okay. Gonna make sure he doesn't see us. Even if I have to hide here, it's fine. Don't see us. Don't see us. Thank God. We've got our sights set on them. The timing's up to you. Mm, we'll take them down. I don't want to risk getting caught by them. Ooh, you're new. First move is ours. Ugh. How do we take you down? Mm, good guess. Good guess. We got him. It's almost scary how good I am. Okay, you're level nine. All right, let's talk to him. Lend me thy power. So you like want to talk? We don't really know each other very well at all. Jeez. Look, let's just say that I, I was in the wrong. All right. So won't you calm down already? You know, if you're going willing to let us go, I'll make it worth your while. I'm already taken. What do you mean worth my while? Um. Oh, interested. You're a boy after all. Not to put away that gun if you want to treat. So. Oh yes, I heard that humans, human women often trick their lovers into meeting their parents. If your girlfriend asked you. If you were free to have dinner with her friends, what would you say? I'm busy. Sorry. I suppose... I suppose it would be awkward to suddenly meet my parents. That's what she'll say. Ooh. Oh, our tastes actually match, hmm? Wait, I remember... So oh, this is going good. No, I'm understanding the sass of these personas now. These shadows, I'm actually getting it. I came from the Arya of the soul. I am a persona. Too good for this Madarame. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, power mask. You've got a new mask, Joker. Damn, that was smooth, Joker. You know how to talk to the ladies. Every Persona protagonist is a gigolo, I tell you. Okay. Well, are you an item to steal? You are. Give me. Give me, give me. I don't have to worry about as much slipping under these little things. Oh, actually. Well, we can probably run right past this guy. Strike. Oh, I could have, I could have just slipped past that other guy and just went here. Oh, that's kind of annoying. This guy though, he's kind of in the way, so I'm gonna have to take him out. True form. Now's our chance to strike. Waterside nymph. Fire, thunder, something. Well, we'll hear Joker up. Good old kitty cat's been using a lot of SP. Ooh, we could try Miragi. Do it on. Okay, it wasn't anything crazy. Oh, we have double fangs. I forgot about that. No. We have somebody that has some elements that we can utilize, right? Miragi didn't work. See it is. Ah, that was a good guess. Good guess. Cool, Joker. Level 11. Yeah, we can create this, actually. Lend me your power. Well, we must talk things over first, yes. I know nothing about you, after all. It's frustrating when others bother me and I have things to do. Won't you just leave me be? Is that reverse psychology? Is that how you interrupt interpreted my remarks? Please understand that such was not my intention. For now, I suspect that you've decided to hear me out. Am I not right? Why have you decided to be more commutative with me? 
You seem useful. Do you believe so? I have my strong points and weaknesses. I see. Please take this as a small glyph. Oh, damn it. It is fair that I tell you that you're mistaking if you think you can oppose Lord Madarame. Don't you dare run away. Let's Damn it. Back for now. I should have picked that option. I was hoping it would work. Beauty might have been the better one then. We just wasted that. Like, we could have gotten a persona out of it. We wasted that SP. Well, at least we're down to the zero Somewhere. on the meta. We won't get found out. Ugh. Interruptions abound today. So we can't go through on the left from what we see. Ooh, that makes it really bright. But the right is a place to slip through, it seems. I can feel it. Question is, is there anyone it. waiting to ambush us? To trap us? No. No, we're probably okay. <sighs> These lasers just made me, like, super on edge. What does this do? Oh. Lifts the gates, I guess. Oh, that's going to be easier. We won't have to slip around and go through all those mobs if we come back. Oh, what's through here? Oh, yeah. More guards. Oh, gosh. I just keep sliding everywhere. Because the X prompt just kept happening. It's like, no, no, you're going this way. You're going this way, guy. I need to find a way to sneak around. I can't jump down there. Well, that makes things a little more difficult. Especially the pattern these guys are making. Like, stop it! I need to slip around behind you. Well, you turn around. Uh, I can get away with it. I'm not going to bother with them. But, oh, there's a chest there. Those bastards. They make me really want to go over there. I might have to take them out. I gotta be really quick here, because if they turn around... Yeah, we're probably screwed already. Oh! We did it! Oh, <laughs> that was so close! Okay. Now, what do we have from that? I wasn't paying attention, because I was just like, don't get caught, don't get caught. Did we get anything cool from it? Any equipment items? Grimy gear, we still have some of that. And I don't see anything else here. Oh yeah, there's also like a ton, a ton of different outfits you can wear, I guess. I got them all off the store. The dance wear, it's just so stylish though. Yeah, I think I might have, uh, I saw like a, one of the yellow items. I'm assuming that was probably something to do with, oh, training whip. Oh wow. Okay, that's a lot better. Leather whip. A little kinky, aren't we on? But I also saw, like, an item from the loots, I think. Yeah, it was a pearl. We didn't have one of those before. I just sold all the items. Alright, in this way. Hey! We'll be in an unknown territory once we get past here, right? Security will probably get a lot more fierce as well, meow. Fierce as a tiger. Make sure you don't touch anything or run into any displays, alright? What are you looking at me for? I'm not that clumsy. Yeah, he's the best runner here, don't you know, Magana? Something written here. The Infinite Spring. And yeah, we've already went through that once. We have an idea of what's going on. Midor was making noises. It scared me for a minute. Oh, what is through this door? The first exhibition room. Or exhibition room. Hmm. No shadows to immediately blindside us. That's one good thing. Go this way, you say. All right, it's a peculiar sign. We'll do that. I can feel it. It's somewhere. You can feel the danger. <gasps> what? Oh, perfect. A safe room. You gotta make those safety saves, because when this game wipes you, it wipes you completely and utterly, and then everyone dies. Sweet. I think we're going to be able to come right back here if we want to. Yeah, we all need a break sometimes. Sorry, no. What am I doing? Save data. I should write something. Never have too many of those safety saves. 